What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, reliable AMT, make sure to hit up my sponsor and use code BUGS for 5% off checkout. Links down below in the description. Hit them up right now. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 Mun My Team video. And guys, today we are going to go over the top snipe filters in NBA 2K21 right now, right this second. So guys, if you are new, smash that like button. Let's hit 100 likes on this video for this amazing content. Drop the sub, man. If you guys need MT, make sure to hit me up on Twitter. I could arrange you guys some MT. And yeah, we're going to do giveaways very soon on Twitter. As you guys can see, my MT is up. How did I get it up? We're going to show you in this video, top snipe filters in the video game right now, man. There is a lot of methods. We're also going to have another video after this and possibly a stream. So yeah, man, we just hit all-time domination. If you guys are having trouble with some domination, man, make sure to check out my best playbook video. I have a play that is simply the easiest play to run in NBA 2K21, my team. And uh, hopefully, hopefully you guys do find this um, video easily, easily helpful. And yeah, domination, man. You're going to get a lot of tokens. I'm already on the Ruby stage. My team isn't the best, man. I decided to sell most of my cards because right now, cards are very expensive. So if you have any Amethyst cards, Diamond cards, uh, Ruby cards, just get rid of them, man. It's not worth holding on to. And you could still complete domination with this squad I'm running now. This is the squad. This is actually my limited squad. This is my domination squad right here. It's nothing special, guys. Nothing special whatsoever. But anyways, guys, let's get into the snipe filters, man. So... Let's get into it, man. We're going to start off with Amethyst, and then we're going to go to Amethyst 20. Because, first off, Amethyst went up so much. And if you guys did listen to me and you guys did invest, you're going to make lots of MT. The Amethysts are all big time, guys. Sean Mary was around 13,000 MT. In my video, I did sell them for that price after I packed them. Same with uh, Richard Jefferson, man. Now they're up to around 18,000 MT. So, this Amethyst filter might be one of the best filters in the game right now. You could possibly get an NBA 20 player for the low. Because NBA 20 players are also pretty expensive. So definitely try out this filter. You could possibly make hundreds of thousands of MT. Just saying, man, sniping comes with patience. If you're not a patient person, sniping isn't for you. Just try grinding some offline game modes like Dom Offline or TTO Online. Even Limited, man. If you get Ralph Sampson at the end of the year, that's a W. I just started playing Limited. I'm so far 2-0. Have not seen the ring yet. If you guys did get ring success, please let me know down below in the description or in the comments, I should say. The next filter, man, Amethyst 20. This filter right here is straight cash. Um, it, has, it, it requires you to get a decent amount of MT, though. So if you don't have a decent amount of MT like I do, try to get to at least 50K, man. Once you get to 50K, you should be rolling in MT, okay? Um, right here, man, 34,000 MT for the man, Kawhi Leonard. This is a pretty, pretty good value card. Um, you could try snacking, guys. Amethyst 20s, if you have any, if you invest in any, I will most likely recommend you guys do sell your Amethyst 20s because they're very expensive. And not only that, these cards are not good whatsoever. As you guys can see, this Kawhi only has silver badges, bro. No gold badges. Comparing him to my butler, man, he's not good. Now, let's see if we compare him to something different. So, okay. Let's compare to Luke Walton, bro. Luke Walton Sapphire pretty much has more badges, guys. So, yeah, his stats are better. But in my opinion, if you have no badges, it's not really going to work out. So you could try out this Amethyst 20 filter, not going to lie, on Sundays, these filters are going to be very slow. Sunday usually is a day to sell your cards, in which I'm telling you guys to sell your cards, you're going to make the most MT in that case, if you do sell your cards today. So Amethyst 20 is definitely a very good filter. Don't worry guys, we're going to have some cheap filters for you guys, if you are newcomers, very soon in this video. So next up, we got the diamond filter, this requires, is requires, wow, the diamonds are all big time guys, the market is super high we're gonna make a video on the market right after this but yo eighty thousand mt for larry bird i find that incredible and also we are going to do a pack and play series very very soon most likely friday guys we'll probably start it up friday um this is crazy larry bird was 65k not too long ago now he's up to eighty thousand mt if i were you guys and you plan on popping packs this year right now is probably your best time to pop packs okay Definitely try it out. Next filter, man. We got the Ruby filter. Strictly Ruby because Rubies do pop up a lot. They feel I feel like Rubies and Sapphires, you want to make quicker MT instead of waiting all day. Rubies and Sapphire definitely pop up a lot more than uh, Amethyst and Diamonds. Diamonds and Amethyst are a little more high rarity at this stage in the game. 
So if you guys do want to make MT faster, my Ruby method is probably the one for you. And as you guys can see, I've been grinding XP. If you didn't check that video out, make sure to check it out. But yeah, Ruby filter is pretty solid. Not gonna lie, it's nothing. It's nothing amazing unless you do get some rare rubies. One rare ruby. We're about to show you actually because he's very rare. We're gonna go over Gus Williams, man. DVG did hype this man up. He's very fast. He's got like 99 speed. But uh, yeah, Ru Gus Williams is supposedly the man to snipe right now. So if I were you, I would definitely try sniping this card out. I doubt people know how much ruby Gus Williams is actually going for. At least half the community. I know DVG does have 200k subs, but I don't know. I don't know, man. I heard Gus Williams going for the high, and looks like he is, man. This card's freaking rare as hell. Let's check out his speed, because I'm hearing his speed is stupid fast. 96 speed, yeah. As you guys can see, comparing it to my Ruby Lillard, I thought my Ruby Lillard... This is free agent Lillard, by the way. He's fast, and I guess the CPU, if you could run this card, this is probably a make or break in the game. Not only that, man. Obviously, he can't shoot. Realistically, who cares? Shooting's hard this year. He's got a great perimeter, great steal, and 90-something speed. So, I don't know, man. This card is fast as hell. I would definitely recommend you try sniping out this card. Like I said, all these snipe filters are going to be very slow today, guys. It's Sunday. There's no new content. Usually, snipe filters are a lot better on new content days. But let's get to the next one. This one moves a little bit faster. This might be popping on a Sunday. Not totally sure. As you guys can see, that's a miss. But Sapphires, man... You could get these cards for the low, and you could sell them for like 500 MT profit, man. It, it, it all depends on what you exactly get, but Sapphires are definitely a lot easier to snipe. So if I were you, if you have low MT, you want to make MT here and there, definitely try that out. Next up, man, we got the Pistons Playbook Filter, man. This playbook is the best playbook in the game. If you guys don't know, make sure to check out my video, guys. This playbook is incredible, and it's going for, I think, something over 5,000 MT. This playbook is just so damn good. I completed all the dominations by spamming this playbook. And as you guys can see, I did snipe out a business playbook for 100 MT on my video. So um, if you guys didn't know, man, I made about 8,000 MT easily off this filter, man. Some people do not know that the Pistons playbook is this good. It's the bronze playbook, by the way. It's not the silver playbook. It's the bronze one. So... Try to get the bronze playbook on a snipe. You can make 8,000 MT easily. And some people just throw them up for 1,000 MT because they don't care. And realistically, this does sell. It sold. I got two of them on my video and they all sold for 8,000 MT. So definitely, if you do get this, make sure to let me know down in the comments down below. We're going to have another video on MT methods. So right after this, man, we're going to find, we found the number one MT method in the game right now. So if you guys are new, man. Smash that like button, drop the sub. That's really all we got for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Have a good one. Peace.